Since the 1950s, it served as office space at Spear and Sixth. Now everything's accessible to me. And for Rashid Sales, the old Silverado office building is home. I was working high rise construction. You know, I was doing good, had no issues. Um, Run my bike 20 miles a day. A gunshot injury to his back put Rashid into a wheelchair. This comes with a lot. This chair comes with a lot. You know what I'm saying? And my injury comes with a lot. Rashid is now among the first people to move into the renovated building, a place focused mostly on seniors who are at risk of becoming homeless or who are released from Denver Health with nowhere to go. Like I said, it's a blessing. I thank God that um, I was accepted into the program. The Denver Housing Authority bought the office building from Denver Health in 2020 for $5 million. And finally, 110 units are now ready thanks to $18 million in tax credits. One floor is still operated by Denver Health and will house people transitioning from the hospital to the outside world. These are our friends and neighbors throughout Denver that are in need of affordable housing. Rents will range from $650 to $1,700 per month. And to be able to repurpose a building that's already here, that's so centrally located, has access to amenities, is really quite incredible. And again, it's 100% affordable. So yeah, this is another beginning for me. For Rashid, it's a new home so he can focus on getting better without getting stressed about shelter or a bed, a way to get back on his feet again. I'll be all right. I'll be walking hopefully by the summer. That's my goal. Yeah, let's hope so. It's expected the building will be at capacity sometime in the spring of next year. A spokesperson for the Department of Housing Stability said they couldn't confirm if anybody moving in there right now will be counted towards Mayor Johnston's goal of getting 1,000 people off the street by the end of this year, but they did say it's possible in the near future. Tom, Kim, back to you. This building, this place has been a long time coming, though. Yeah, they bought it in 2020, so for the past three years, it's been you know under renovations. The paint is new. It's fresh, new kitchenettes, so it's uh, brand new all on the inside. All right. All right, yeah. thanks, Jeremy. Mm -hmm.